going to show you how to make the Waist Shaper Woven Star. What you'll need are small pieces of fabric and also the 70mm Waist Shaper. If you want more information about the Waist Shaper, then please check out our videos. So what you need to make the star are four fabrics. We've chosen four different prints and four pieces of Waist Shaper that are 10 inches long. You're going to fuse the waist shaper onto the reverse of each of the fabrics. Simply place it on and fuse the waist shaper in place. If you want more information, check out the video. Once you've fused the waist shaper on each piece, leave it for about 20 to 30 minutes to allow the glue to adhere correctly to the reverse of each fabric. Once each one is fused, using the perforated line, just fold in the sides fold it in half and all we're going to do with each piece is simply sew down each long length. Once you've finished stitching you're going to fold each of the strips in half with about an inch here overlap and then just get a quilt clip and pop it in place. Do that with each one. So now take two of your fabric loops, lie one horizontal with the overlap on the left hand side as you're looking at it, and the other one have it vertically with the overlap at the top, and simply pop the horizontal one inside the vertical one. Take a third loop and have it so the overlap is on your right hand side, and you're going to slot that loop all the way over Keep the quilt clip in position and so it looks like that. Take the fourth loop with the overhang to the bottom and slide it over this one. And this feels a little bit awkward, but you're just going to pop that tail through that loop. And what will happen is this will all lock together. Once you have it like this, you need to physically turn the whole thing over. So the longer edges of your loop is, are now lying on the top. And what we're going to do is literally fold this one over, this one over, this one over. And then the final one is going to go over, but slip it through that loop. and that locks everything into place. So to create the corners, you're taking the long loop, you're going to fold it in half, so you have a 45 degree angle. It's now easier if you flip it over and fold it in half again. It creates what looks like an arrowhead. Fold all of this in half again, so the it's lying on top of itself and this long end is going to tuck underneath the loop. Just take your time doing this and it'll lock into position and it creates your star point. And repeat that on all four sides. Once you've done that, it'll look like this one and you're all ready to put a little hanging loop which you could just attach by a small stitch in the back or a glue dot and hang it on a tree. As you can see, Vlieseline has a wide range of products, each with different properties and benefits for your projects. You can view the whole range on the Vlieseline website where you can download the brochure which has detailed information on all of the products across our four categories. You can also join the conversation with us on our Facebook page, Creative Community Group and Instagram. All of the details are below.